have, of course, some problem spots. So it is starting to pick up for some areas, a spring. So this gets difficult anyway through rush hour, but we're looking at Slauson Avenue. We had a couple cars involved in a crash here, but the backup is down to about Downey Santa Fe Springs all the way up into Commerce, and it's really just getting worse on the 5 North. If you do have the option, 710 is looking much better. You also have Telegraph to take as some alternates, so just in case you do want to get around some of that backup. We'll take a quick look at real time traffic. moving smoothly here. It's starting to get busier out there, but the worst backup is that area that we do have on that portion of the 5. Scott Reif. Several days getting down to some upper 80s today, mid 80s on your Saturday. Then Sunday, the next warm up begins and we begin to get hot again as we head into next week. So enjoy at least the first half of the weekend. And then as we get into next week, we're going to start to see the much warmer temperatures and then also the possibility for some looks like right now weak Santa Ana winds. But either way, offshore winds expected next week. All right, we'll have another check in just a bit, Mark. I'll send it back to you. Looking forward to okay, this Brianna, forecast as well over the next several days. It's going to start to feel like we're getting closer to fall for uh, a couple days. So that's going to be degrees. really got down to 48 over into Big Bear this morning. And then elsewhere, we're at about 66 degrees over into Covina with more marine layer clouds that have moved inland this morning, too. So we're seeing a bit more coverage uh, from that as well. And that will also help us to cool down. So we have high pressure continues to get nudged out to the east now and low pressure that's over into the Pacific Northwest beginning to drop down a little more. And then it's going to swing over Oregon in the northernmost areas of California as we get into your Friday and your Saturday. And that's that's what's going to help us cool off even more as we head into the weekend. Then this trough will continue to dig in off the West Coast Saturday. After that, it begins to lift out and high pressure moves back in. And then we will get warmer as we get into the beginning of next week. We'll get back to hot temperatures. And then we also have a chance of some offshore winds too beginning next Sunday week. will be the warmer day at the beach Orange if you County. are making beach plans this weekend. So uh, if you're looking for warmer weather, that's the day to go. And then as we head into next week, we're going to stay. Today, we're going to get down to some 80s there as well Friday, Saturday, and the next week we are back to hot weather, triple digit heats coming on back, Mark, but it'll be a nice little break in the meantime. Back to